morning mamas it's Gina so we're getting some stuff done around the house before Declan wakes up I wanted to share with you my dishwashing routine I used the Dr. Brown bottles when I first started using these I was really overwhelmed because there are so many parts but it is not that complicated I promise so I'm gonna put one together real quick for you and then we'll take it apart okay here's your bottle together Screw the top off, that's pretty easy. So what I do is fill this part up with soap and let it sit. Take these apart. And then the topper, the nipple just pops right out. So the soap I use is this dabble soap. I really love it. Um, again, I don't get any sort of um, promotional credits or anything like that at this time. I'm gonna use the brush that comes with Dr. Brown. I run everything over with this soap, and then there are holes. So you go through the first hole, and the second one in the bottom. And then I love this brush right here. Comes apart in two. So I will get you guys the link for that too. And these I just clean out here. I also went through this right here. The first brush. I look in here for any sort of milk stuff and I just scrub it with this little wand. Same on the back, right there. You see? And then in this area, it gets a lot. So you'll see, nothing should be yellowed. Sometimes, if it's really bad, I can clean the sides here. You notice a lot of the little bars, those ridges, they get stuff in them sometimes. And same thing on the inside, anything with ridges. Check your tops always. And then the nipple, I just run this brush right through it. So for me, that works out really well. I always am sure to use very hot water and clean up these brushes and soap before I push it back together to use the big brush. So this part, I push it in here. And be careful, you wanna get the full bottom and then put it in the sink because as you pull it out, it goes slowly. That's a little splashy over here. So I clean up my little brush. And then it's as simple as rinsing everything out. But I also want to make sure you my drying rack. I love this drying rack. We've had it since day one. And it is just wonderful. So it doesn't have to be this one, but if you do get a different one, and make sure they really are useful. So I do not use steamers. I do not use steam bags. And I've had a really good success. My bottles are always clean. And then that one looks really good with them. So we have to use the Dr. Browns all the way up through um, until he gets to a zippy cup. So good luck. Let me know what you like to use.